Welcome, everybody, to another episode of TechFlix. My name is Joe Marquez, your friendly neighborhood ed tech coach. And today we're continuing our Parent Square series. And today we're going to dive in deeper into posts. And the question I have for you is, what if you have a post you've been working on, but you're not ready to send it out? What if you want to send it out later? What if you want to work on it again later? What if you did send out a post, but you want to edit it? This is your episode. So we're going to take a look at Parent Square scheduled drafts and past posts right now. So here is a post that I'm getting ready to send out, but I'm like, you know what? Um, my post is ready, right? So my post is ready, but I don't want to send it out till the end of the day. That is an indication that you want to schedule your post for later. So I can come up here to where it says post now, but instead of selecting post now, I'm going to hit this down arrow and I'm going to select schedule. And this now allows me to say, you know what? I want to send this out. Um, I want to send it out uh, today, uh, right today, but I don't want to send it out until this afternoon. So I'm going to say 3 p.m. Um, now, be very careful that you change that PM. We don't want to be scheduling a post to be sent to parents at 3 a.m. That could be an issue. Uh, so once you've done this, you can hit schedule and you're done. It is now scheduled and it will be posted exactly at 3 p.m. Okay, so that's that instance. What if you've been working on this post, but you get a phone call or you're working on this post and you have to go to a meeting? Um, you can't just exit out of this post because it doesn't automatically save it. So that is when it's an indication that you want to save this as a draft. So you would select here and hit save as a draft. Okay, we're going to do that here in just one second. Uh, but what if you did post this? You posted it now. You've selected your group and you've posted it now. Um, what if you've done that, but you're like, oh, I, I want to add this. Or you know what? I forgot to attach a file that I wanted my, my parents to click and download. I, I, need, to, I need to add that. Um, that's when you would go to your account and select your past post. I'm going to show you how to do that as well. Uh, so we're going to skip. We're going to draft this post right now. So I'm going to select the down arrow and select save as a draft. Okay. So where does it go? Where do I go? How do I get it? Well, that is where the my account option comes in. We have a whole episode on everything that is in the my account page, but today we're going to focus on scheduled and draft posts and past posts. So I'm going to click on the my account right here and then off to the left hand side under activity, you can see that I have posts and scheduled and drafts. So this is where I would go to my past posts, okay? So let's say I, I select this past post and I go, you know what? I sent out this really good thing right here, but I forgot to add something to it. Again, this is where all of your past posts are located. So I'm gonna select my past post. I'm gonna select edit and then I'm going to attach my file. Oh my goodness, I forgot to attach the entrance uh, fee or something to it. So I'm gonna come here, grab my file. I'm gonna make sure that I attach it. I click upload. That file gets attached to your post. Um, you can see it down here now, it's attached. And then I'm gonna hit save. Right, so this is a past post. I've now attached this document that parents can click on and go to. Um, what if you posted this on Monday, but you want to remind the parents that uh, on Wednesday, hey, we have the fair again. You don't want to create a brand new post. You select send update, right? So uh, just a reminder, tomorrow is the day. Fair time, okay? Uh, and so then I would hit submit, and it it all it does is it actually uh, reminds the parents on their app, on their uh, text, in an email um, that this post exists, and then there's that update to that post. So that is how, what you do to uh, go in with any past posts right there. Like, what if what if you uh, scheduled that post or you want to check your draft post. That's where I go to schedule, 
scheduled and draft posts right here. And I can see right off to the side all my different drafts and then all my different scheduled posts. I can see my scheduling post October 18th at 3 p.m. That is going to be going out. That's excellent. So we're good to go there. Um, what about my draft posts? Uh, I can come over here and go, okay, I'm ready to finish this. I click on it and I'm right back to drafting my post. So that, my friends, is how you can interact with past posts, scheduled posts, and draft posts by going to your My Account menu and selecting off to the left-hand side the activities under Posts, Scheduled, and Draft Posts. Uh, keep checking back to our TechFlix menu for future Parent Square and other EdTech applications. If there's any other future videos you'd like to see, you know who I am, you know how to contact me, and I'd love to make a video just for you. Have yourselves a wonderful, wonderful day.